So thank you for the question. First of all, we don't have any such legislation here in Ghana. A bill has been proposed to the Parliament of Ghana, which has all kinds of ramifications, which is now being considered by the Parliament. It hasn't been passed, so the statement that there is legislation in Ghana to that effect is not accurate. No legislation. The bill is going through the Parliament. It's going through the Parliament. The Attorney General has found it necessary to speak to the committee about it regarding the constitutionality or otherwise of several of its provisions, and the Parliament is dealing with it. But at the end of the process, I will come in. But in the, in the meantime, the Parliament is dealing with it. And I have no doubt that the Parliament of Ghana will show, as it has done in the past, one, first of all, its sensitivity to human rights issues, as well as to the feelings of our population, and will come out with a responsible response to the, to, to the proposed. The legislation was a legislation that has been provided provi as a private member's bill. This is not an official legislation of the government, but it is one that has been uh, being mooted by a handful of private members. So we will see what the final outcome of it. But I'm, uh, my understanding from the recent discussion I had with the chairman of the committee, the substantial elements of the bill have already been modified as a result of the intervention of the Attorney General. We will see what the final outcome will be. And that is the stage at which I will also have the opportunity to prevent. As far as the presence of, of Wagner is concerned, we're concerned about it. We may not clear our concerns um, because, first of all, it, it, it raises the very real possibility, which is one that we need all of us in the, on the region and the continent to be aware of, that once again, our continent is going to become the playground for great power conflict. Because one group of people coming, whether they are an official or an unofficial group, all of us know the realities of what's going on. It's not very difficult for another group of people to say, there, there, we'll come. And before you know it, the, the, the issues of, of concern to us, keeping our country and continent free of great power rivalry, will be a reality with us. So that's our major preoccupation. Uh, and on, uh, as, uh, yes, and, and but in any event also, we want to be in a position to resolve our own security problems ourselves, if as much as possible without the intervention of foreign troops. The presence of Al-Qaeda in Ghana, I don't know. I, or, or formally, we don't have any uh, information to that effect. I may well be that there are cells, etc., already in the country, but those are matters that the security agencies are very much on top of. And we're hoping that there will be no Al-Qaeda presence in Ghana. Uh, that has to be the wish of anybody who is a friend of this country and who wishes the Ghanaian people well. Thank you.